In cycling, we use something called a pace line to help carry everyone through the end by letting them draft. Is your content marketing using a pace line to help your customers get all the way through to the end? If not, they're probably dropping off like flies. The idea of pacing within the content marketing piece is simple. Get people through to the end of it. Whatever it is you want them to take away from it, it's usually at the end. Whether it's a sales pitch, a request for them to follow or subscribe, or come see us now, or hey, it's on sale through the end of today only. Whether it's video, audio, or written, there's always a way to pace people through. With video, it could just be something as simple as changing the angle, or busting in a new uh, clip to show how something works, whatever it is you're talking about and illustrate. For blog posts and written content, a great tip comes from my friend Andy Crestedina at Orbit Media. He shows how as you scroll through a, like a longer blog post, and longer usually works better, then you want to break up the visual with pictures and bullet point lists and subheadings and bigger headings and tables and charts and graphs and all that because no matter where the reader is on the screen, they should be able to see something else coming up that makes them want to scroll just a little bit more and then just a little bit more and then just a little bit more, making it all the way through to the end of your piece of content. There are a lot of really good reasons for making people stick with your content all the way through to the end besides just delivering your message. But I'll touch on those later. Thanks for watching. Make sure you hit like and subscribe or follow whatever it is, wherever you're watching this. Cheers.